just met a fellow van dweller. <laughs> and uh, what's, what did you say your name was? My name is Jack. Jack. And uh, what, let's see, what kind of what, what kind of unit have you got here? What is this? It's an Astro. Uh, it's a uh, <laughs> Chevrolet Astro 1998. You're, not, you're cargo. not in the film. Uh, wow. This is my my design of. Uh, it's like a half. Oh, I see. You can flip a, this up. It's half of a Murphy bed, and you, you could call it that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's cool. So everything on the floor just is in this is in this thing, eh? Yeah. So. So it's really not on the floor. Yeah. It's just hanging in that. Well, as you saw, the battery on that side. It's my inverter, and my inverter is. Uh, you built this all yourself? I did. Wow. And the inverter, you see this cable here going in there? Yeah. So this is uh, hooked up. You're, you're, you're cleaner than me. This is hey, this is nice. You see, that's the main thing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Is a bed. You got to have a place to sleep, and you spend a third of your life there. So look at this. He's got fans. He's got uh, um, storage. Yeah, so both these fans, yeah. like as of yesterday, they were hooked up to the front. So I was drawing power from my car battery. Now you're. But as of today, I hooked them up here, so they're now drawing power from from my house battery. Oh, that's how you got that wire. Look at that. Yeah, well, he did it. The guy. It's amazing. And this is your MPPT it. controller. Yeah. You know, all the lights, whatever's happening, and. Yeah. Twelve volts, I guess, to to fill up the house battery. Yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm guessing. Oh, you got oh, a good okay. setup. Amperage, three point one eight amperage. Battery is full, 14 volts. I don't know if you can see this on your camera. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, oh you can leave it. <laughs> uh, what's that, 48 watts. That's the power, I guess, the panel is providing Remote to the battery. Meter. Look at that. I guess, like really, I, <laughs> I'm just learning all this stuff. I'm, I am no expert. That's well put together at least anyway. To start, yeah. Oh, perfect. I can show nope. you the... Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so that's that yeah and Jack said he'd got some new solar panels put on today I think he said 250 watts I'm not quite too sure 250 300 watts I'm not sure but you think solar is new let me show you some really early solar this is back in the 1890s Okay. So. Oh, there you go. Yeah, the only thing that's related to my solar setup under the hood it's currently is this, this brand solenoid. New. Yeah. So basically, it, I think it draws one amp from here. Okay. This is a switch uh, fuse for safety. Oh. Oh. And. Uh, oh, look at that. Yeah. And it's I, uh Okay, it is an actual fuse. It's a fuse. Yeah. So. Okay. This black wire runs underneath my, my uh, the undercarriage that's a positive and it goes to my house battery at okay the back. and the guy who installed it told me that if ever I'm in the middle of nowhere and I kill my my engine battery uh -huh. I can take a short piece of wire right and connect this one to this one and just get enough to jump it will what it will do apparently is it will use a solar panel to trickle charge to the engine battery I don't know how that works well okay now this is not connected to the, to this in any shape or form like the yeah. engine battery is completely separate from the solar system <laughs> yeah, <she has> right <laughs> on. <laughs> so that, that, maybe I can close, close yeah. the hood now because there's nothing else to show here no that's as good as far as the solar setup goes all right guys off to breakfast bonds off Broadway all day breakfast 295 with the coffee, you'll pay about five bucks, five fifty, I think, or something like that for a breakfast and a coffee. Breakfast consists of a couple of eggs, uh, hash browns with onions, uh, your choice of sausage, bacon, or ham, uh, then and your coffee. Great place.
uh, all day breakfast, and it's the one with all the graffiti all over the, the walls and the ceiling, the floor, everything's got graffiti in it. And while I was there, I noticed this trike that had uh, set up for Halloween here. I just had my phone with me. Sorry, guys, uh, no stabilization whatsoever. So I, this video is horrible with the. I, I, I'm used to my other camera now with all the stabilization on it. Bonds off Broadway, guys. You got to come down and, and check it out. Great little restaurant. Uh, graffiti all over the walls on the inside. It's like your uh, greasy spoon place. Uh, cheap. And then while I was at it, I went over to talk to Scott, help him install his diesel heater in his Beautiful. truck and camper. What we're doing. What we're doing. putting the old gas tank in, fuel tank, and the heater. And then, on the inside, oh, it really picks up light pretty good, even in here. The uh, exhaust is out there, and then right here is the thermostat. Perfect. I'll hook it up, ready to go. So that all fits, eh? Seems pretty low, but I guess 